Are you curious about the identity of this person? Do you want to ask about no. it? No, no, because no, there's, there's no conspiracy here. There's... Senator Ron Johnson insisting he had no role or knowledge of a plan to hand deliver fake electors from Wisconsin and Michigan to Vice President Mike Pence. We, you know, trust me, when this news broke, I asked the questions. Nobody knows. And these, these just these are interns. There's yeah. there's staff. Okay, we have no idea. The text exchange revealed during the January 6th committee hearing shows a top aide to Johnson texting Pence's team saying Johnson needs to hand something to the vice president, explaining it was an alternative slate of electors from Wisconsin and Michigan because the National Archives didn't receive them. Pence's team said no. It's a new revelation that I think just opens up a whole range of new questions about what was going on behind the scenes between House members and, Senate, uh, and senators, uh, among staffers through the White House and Capitol Hill uh, as part of an elaborate, although obviously um, ill-fated scheme to, to try to get the election turned in the direction of former President Trump. Wisconsin Republicans did mail their unofficial slate of electors to the National Archives in December. Secretary of State Doug LaFollette, who certified the official Democratic electors, recently telling 12 News Republicans also asked him to do the same with theirs. They brought them to the office and I smiled and put them in a drawer and forgot about them. In a text disclosed Tuesday, Republican Party of Wisconsin Executive Director Mark Jefferson texted on January 4th, freaking Trump idiots want someone to fly original elector papers to the Senate president. They're going to call one of us to tell us what is going on. So at this hour, there are still a lot of unknowns here. Who delivered or sent those original Republican documents to Senator Johnson's office and when? And what, if any, role the Trump campaign played, Joyce? Now, Matt, I know you also reached out to numerous Republicans for comment about this today. Including Senator Johnson, Mark Jefferson, and several of those Republican electors all either declined or didn't respond.